thoughts on the president's docket for today. Let's see. First, the meeting with Chinese President Hu Jintao, then a phone meeting with British Parliament member David Watts, and a few minutes with the Potato Growers of Idaho lobby group at 3. Now, I don't think that should pose any problems. Hey, uh, but... What are you doing here? I'm supposed to start work today, helping you manage all the president's appointments. Really? Well, that's good. I'm grateful for any help I can get. But you know what's the funny thing? I always have trouble keeping straight the names of all the politicians and such in the news. They all sort of run together for me. So, do you think you could just give me a crash course to keep me from embarrassing myself? <laughs> Well, okay, real quick. Take today's docket, for example. Who's the president of China? What's the member of the British Parliament? Idaho's coming in at three. Yeah, that's what I want to find out. I say, who's the president of China? What's the member of Parliament? Idaho's coming in at three. Are you the president's chief of staff? Yes. And you keep track of his schedules and all his appointments? Yes. You don't know the fellow's names? Well, I should. Well, then, who's the president of China? Yes. I mean the fellow's name. Who? The president of China. Who? The Chinese president. Who? The guy who runs... Who is in China? I'm asking you who's in China. That's the man's name. That's whose name? Yes. Well, go ahead and tell me. That's it. That's who? Yes. Look, has China got a president? Certainly. Who's the president of China? That's right. When the president of China addresses the people, who gives the speech? Every word of it. All I'm trying to find out is the name of the president of China. Who? The guy that gives... That's it. Who gives the speech? He does. Every word. Sometimes his spokesman gives it for him. Who's spokesman? Yes. What's wrong with that? Look, all I want to know is when the president of China signs a treaty or what have you with the U.S., how does he sign his name? Who? The guy. Who? How does he sign? That's how he signs it. Who? Yes. All I'm trying to find out is what's the name of the president of China? No, Watts is a member of the British Parliament. I'm not asking you who's in Parliament. Who's in China? One country at a time! Well, don't change the politicians around. I'm not changing nobody. Take it easy, buddy. I'm only asking you who's the president of China. That's right. Okay. All right. What's the name of the president of China? No, what's the member of parliament? I'm not asking you who's in parliament. Who's in China? I don't know. They're not on until 3 o'clock. We're not talking about them. Now, how did I get to 3 o'clock? Well, you mentioned the appointment. If I mentioned the 3 o'clock appointment, who did I say is coming in at 3? Now, who's president of China? What's president of China? What's in parliament? I don't know. They're in at 3. There I go, back on 3 again. Well, could you just stay at 3 o'clock and don't get off it? All right. What do you want to know? Now, who's coming in at 3? Why do you keep putting who at 3 o'clock? What am I putting at 3 o'clock? No, what's in Parliament? You don't want who in Parliament? No, who is President of China? I don't know. 3, three o'clock. o'clock. Look, what else have you got scheduled this week? Hmm, let's see here. On Wednesday, the President is showing his interest and concern for the little guy by paying a visit to a tiny town in Montana. In the town's name? Why? I just thought I'd ask you. Well, I just thought I'd tell you. Then tell me who's he visiting in Montana. Who's the president of China? I'm not... Stay out of China! I want to know what's the name of the town in Montana. Now, what's in Parliament? I'm not asking you who's in Parliament. Who's in China? I don't know. Three Three o'clock. Okay, how about this? On Friday, the president is going to meet and shake hands with an eight-year-old girl who saved her entire class from a fire. Oh, that's beautiful. And her name is? Tamara. You don't want to tell me today? I'm telling you. Then go ahead. Tomorrow. What time? What time what? What time tomorrow are you going to tell me who's the little girl? Now listen, for the last time, who is not the little girl? I'll break your arm, you say, who's president of China? I want to know what's the little girl's name. What's in Parliament? I don't know. Three Three o'clock. Now listen, the president of China, does he have a chief of staff like you? Certainly. The chief of staff's name? Today. Today. And tomorrow's the little girl. Now you got it. All we got is a couple of days on the docket. You know, I make a pretty good chief of staff, too. Oh? Yeah, so let's say that one of Tamara's classmates that she saved from the fire was the son of the Chinese ambassador. Now, that being the case, me being a good chief of staff, I'd want the Chinese president to congratulate Tamara, too. So I get on the phone to the United States. I call the White House while the president is shaking hands with the little girl. He's there. She's there. I want the president of China to talk to them both. So I take the phone and I hand it to who? Now, that's the first thing you've said right. I don't even know what I'm talking about! All right, so I give the phone to who? Who's busy in a conference call with Watts? Watts is concerned about the potato farmers in Idaho. And the president is done for the day. Next day, he flies out to Montana. Why? I don't know. They're at three, and I don't give a darn. What? I said I don't 
give a darn. Oh, he's our congressman. 